Hello, welcome to SOS Stockport County. Um, I'm Bood FM. My real name is David Graham. My internet nickname's always been Bood, so I've used it for years. Bood78 is my Xbox gamer tag, so I'll just start stick with the nickname, even though it's got no football relevance. I'll just start to stick with it. So yeah, um, this is my first ever series. I don't know if anyone's ever going to watch this. But I am I am gonna have a lot of fun making it. I can't wait really. Uh, I love playing this game, so the fact that I'm gonna be able to play the game and talk out loud without sounding crazy is gonna be mint. So yeah, Stockport County. I've picked Stockport because I work in Stockport. I live close by to Stockport. I've got a good friend who's a county fan. So being a sort of local and from East Manchester, Stockport's quite close to where I live. So you know, I've, I've seen what's happened to the club over the last few years and it's it's been quite sad really because they're a big club. I mean, they've got a 10,000 seat stadium, lots of fans, a lot of history, over 100 years in the uh, football league. So, you know, it's going to be a challenge to get them back in the league. That's my target, back to the league. I'm not dreaming about the Premier League and <laughs> winning the Champions League. I'm keeping that further away for now. I'm just going to have a go at making the series and I'm going to try and get us promoted and see what I can do. I've got a tried and tested tactic that I always use. I like to play control football, I like to pass it about. I don't think I'm going to be able to do that at this level. So I'll have to tinker my tactic. Uh, basically, it's a bit more long ball and, yeah, and see how it works. Um, I've had a pre-season. I'll uh, show you my pre-season. What I've done is, some might call it cheating, but I'm not bothered. <laughs> I organised a few tournaments, um, two of them as you can see I've got uh, on TV because you're playing bigger clubs, it gets in a bit of money, I've got about 300 grand in the bank now, so I, that's great for a non-league club, I'm semi-professional as well, so it's going to work out alright for me, I had two easy peasy tournaments, first one I won, the second one we were getting a bit tired by them, best game, we played PSG Reserves, I just organised it because they had about a week before the season started, and we absolutely dominated him. And that's Paris Saint-Germain. I mean, I know it's their second string, but we're, we're Stockport County, non-league, sixth tier of English football, and we dominated him. Squad-wise, I'll show you my team. I thought I'd get straight to a game. I know I'm going on a bit now, but I didn't want to. I didn't want to bore everybody with all the pre-season. Not yet. I thought let's get straight into it. So I've done all my transferred. I've hired extra staff. Well, as many as I can. Um, I blagged the board in to let me have an extra physio, um, an extra scout. Um, <clears throat> so this is my team. I've got four lads in on long-term loan. I've got Dean Henderson, but he was in already because he was on loan from United. Um, I've got a few good players, actually. I've got four on short-term loans. You're only allowed five loans in your match day squad. So, you know, I'm working with what I can. Also... I've got rid of a few players. I've signed a couple of players. Also, I got in Nathan Luscombe, who, to be fair, for this level looks all right. He was playing for Hartlepool. Anyway, I researched him online. I might just flash a picture up in while I'm when I'm doing the editing. But bloody hell, he's a he's, he's got some timber on in this lad. Uh, no wonder he's pretty slow. But for this level, he's got some ability, so I'm pretty happy with that. Daniel Roberts, another guy at this level, I think could be really good. And you look at his current ability for this league, and he's the superstar, but he hasn't played for two years. He's English, but he's, he spent his entire career in America. So, apart from that, I've got a few other lone players. We're going to see how they go, see what happens. Got rid of a bit of rubbish. Not really got any money. Can't get any money for anyone. Couldn't even get rid of some of them. Two lads have gone out on loan. I've got a few other lads I'm trying to get to Cheadle, who are one of my um, affiliate clubs. So yeah, I reckon we just get straight to it. Stockport County versus Boston United. I do like a 3D pitch. I'm not into the 2D, I'll be honest. I like 2D, but that's because I've played this game for so long. When I first played it, we just had the text, that was it. So when 2D came out, I was like, yeah man, spunked all over it, it was brilliant. Mm -hmm. But when 3D came out, I don't understand. I mean, I know a lot of people like it. It's traditional. It's 2D. It's like watching sensible soccer on my Commodore 64 when I was at school in the 90s. I like 3D, me, because you get to see it a bit more. 
like little cheeky back heels and stuff. Don't know how many cheeky back heels are going to get at this level, but you know, let's see. So yeah, Evans, right winger, he's not the best. Decent young lad. Fitzpatrick's a good little player, but I've only been able to get him on a three month deal, so we'll see how that goes. Roberts. But you know, I've got a bit of faith in this team. If we don't get out of this league, I'm just going to quit. <laughs> nah, we should do. We should. I mean, we're a massive club for this division. Go on. Obajayi, or whatever, however you say his name. I actually went to a county game, the last home game of the season, to do a bit of research, get a bit of video footage. Uh, it looks like B.A. Baracus, Mr. T. He's built like a brick shit house. He's crap. His foot was shit like a 50p piece. Everything that went on it was going bang, bang. Crap. But do you know what? He's a beast. He's got a mohawk, everything. He's, he's an animal. Even on the game, he's got 18 strength. So I've got him as my target, man. We'll see how he does. Big lad, you know. 33? I didn't think he was that old. Go on, go on, get in. Chris Patrick. That's me, uh, young midfielder. Now, he's one of them where it's one of them where you sign some players on loan, and then as the, the pre season progresses, a few other better players pop up, but it's like too late already to, to take anyone else. So I've had to take him on a short term. See what happens in the future. Might be able to extend it. I don't know yet. We'll have to see how it works. But um, Edge of the Park looks all right, doesn't it? It looks bigger than it does in real life. I mean, we've even got um, a corner field in, which is bullshit. But Lascombe. 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 Oh, get in. There you go. Finishing the rate and he's bagged the, bagged the goal for me. The beast. I might have to nickname him Mr. T, you know. He, he just looks like Mr. T. So there you go, lovely little ball in. Roberts, not played for two years, doesn't matter. Straight, that was easy, that. I could have scored that. My gran could have scored that. But well done. Taking control of this game, I'm pretty happy. I mean, pre season's alright. We had them two tournaments where we got spanked on, but that was just about making some money for the club. To take us forward, I've no money to spend, but it's nice to get some money in the, in the bank. So. Nine shots, six on target, our time. All right, what should we say to the boys? I'm gonna calmly say, I'm very pleased, keep going. Kick some ass. So yeah, um, I've done a bit of an experiment, I've never really f fanny about with a pitch much, you know, pitch sizes. I've never been, been at this lower level, so. I don't know if anyone else has ever done this, I don't know if I'm chatting shit, but. My experiment was, I thought, I'd make the pitch, I'm playing wide, I've got wingers, so I thought, make it wide, so we can spread out the play and get down the wings, but because it's non-league and they're all part-timers, I mean, Robert here is probably a butcher in the day, so they're not like super fit, are they? So I've made the pitch shorter, so they don't have to run as much, that's <laughs> just a theory, don't know if it's going to work, we'll see, but yeah, look at him, eh? he's world-class love scum, wait till you see that picture of him with his gut, he's f***ing massive. But Robert, say, eh? not played for two years. He had a couple of injuries in pre-season though, so I'm a bit worried that he might not get a full season out of him, but I think he's going to be quality at this level. Although, just give the ball away with a crappy tackle. Got the ball back, nice ball to O'Hanlon. Trying to get it to the beast, Mr. T. We are playing a bit of long ball. And there's not much quality at this level, is there? And everyone's really in the same boat. Oh, Jesus Christ. That keeper in real life, he got mad at the match in um, the last game of the season I went to watch. He's a United youth keeper. It's quality. Putting a bit of pressure on us now, Boston. We need to... Uh, don't want to let another goal in. 3-1's tidy. I want to keep that. Let's just pause it a sec. See, I like team talk. I don't... Tactically, I don't mess about too much, me. I'm from the old chat manager days when it used to tell you the game itself used to tell you don't piss about too much because your players get confused. And we, as we all know, football players aren't the most intelligent people, so I don't like confusing them too much. So I like a couple of tactics. I stick to them. I very rarely change them, but I do like this. I do like this shouting from the sideline stuff. It's worked for me a lot of the time. So I'm going to tell them to tighten up a bit because they're getting a bit, letting them come on, to, come on to us a bit too much. Fat lads had a knock. Jack Hartley. Now he's another one I've loaned, but only been able to loan him for three months. And I wish I could get him for the full season because he looks like a really good player. 
He's mainly a right winger, but he can play on the left as well. But at this level, he looks he looks really good. I'm gonna give it into the 70th minute, maybe 72 minutes. Might make another change. Come on, lads! Out wide here to Hartley. It's a big lad, isn't it? Whips it in. Oh, oh, oh! Bloody hell! Fitzpatrick spraying it out wide to Conley. Conley, the old boy, gets it in. Come on! That's the thing sometimes at this level. They'll have a sitter and oof it all at bar. Oh, jeez. Let's make a quick change. Richard Brody, I'm going to give him a crack up front. And then that, I'm going to leave it at that. Come on, Roberts. Oof. Mr. T, I'm, I'm definitely, do you know what, I'm going to have to change his name. I can't say it all the time, it's a bit of a, t it's a bit too much. Mr. T would just be dead easy to say. Right, go on Evans lad. Fitzpatrick to Brody. Brody out to Conley, go on Conley. Oh, honestly. Do you know what, go for it, let's go for it. Assertively, push forward boys. Let's get a fourth. We've got a fourth in us here. Ooh, great save. What a save, eh? Point blank shot and he just saved it with ease. Right, come on, Hartley. Come on, do something, lad. Think. Not that. Right, come on, get on to him. Get on him. Pressure him. Pressure. Ooh, ooh. Oh, Brody's injured. Jesus. What's he got a pull damstring? Run it off, lad. Put a sponge on it. Magic sponge it. Right, come on, Fitzpatrick. Just run it out. Keep going. Whip a ball in. Might as well. Oh! Last minute from Evans. I mean, stat-wise, he's not the best. But you know what? He's done all right so far. 4-1. Well impressed. There we go, Fitzpatrick. You heard me shouting. Evans. And Eddie. Brilliant. Brody with his pole down string. Still running though, isn't he? Magic sponge worked. <laughs> right, come on. There we go. 4 1. Full time at Edgy Park. Let's have a chat with the lads. Passionately. Well done. That was a good win. Well happy with that. Okay, so it's my first ever episode. And we started off straight away with a game. I thought we'll just kick off straight away with another game. Uh, and then f carrying on with my next episodes, we'll do like a bit of a recap of some of the games I've played. I mean, to be fair, I'm going to play FC United next. And then I'm going to go away. I'm going to play Telford, North Ferriby, Nuneaton, off camera. And because I live near Staley Bridge, eight far from where I live, and I've got friends from there, I fancy them in my next game. But yeah, I'm going to play FC United next, and then I'll end the episode at that, because uh, obviously it's FC United. I'll admit, I am a Man United fan. Not the biggest fan of FC United. I kind of see them as traitors. You should have stuck with United. What, you know, don't like what you're doing. I'm going to make him my own team. Not a fan of that. So, <laughs> I want to play FC United, and I want to beat him. Okay, the team I'm going with, Christian Dennis. Now, um, he's been injured his first game back here. He's not fully fit, but for a non-league guy, when it comes to a striker, I always look for mainly finishing off the ball and composure. And he's got 13 in all of them. So to me, at this level, that's brilliant. I'm going to play Roberts in a support in a support striker role. Uh, we've got Bell Baggy. I love that name. Abdullah Bull Baggy. Bell Baggy. It's like he's... His mum's from Iran and his dad's from Glasgow or something. Best name ever. Um, yeah, I'm going to go with that. Fitzpatrick again in the middle and playing Montrose as a cracking ball winner. He's playing in the defensive midfield role. Evans back on the right because he played wicked in the last game. Um, we back four. Connolly. I can't say his name. Kuanza. Kuanza. O'Hanlon oh, and Riley. And then, of course, Big Dino in goal before I do anything 
Mr. T. <laughs> Guy's a beast. Stockport County versus FC United. Here we go. Kicking off at the brand new Broaders Park. Lovely pitch. Nice and green. <coughs> oh, come on, boys. Get this away. Get it away. Ooh. Right, Conley, Evans, Dennis, Evans. Come on, lads. Montrose gets it out to Conley. Oh, get in. Bell baggy. I, I upgraded my me, uh, me hardware recently. My old computer had a rubbish graphics card. So I always, always had the normal boots and stuff. Whereas now my new computer. I know it's a little touch, but I love this. Pink boots, orange boots, blue boots, green boots. It's brilliant. Ooh. Bell baggy with a corner. Whips it out to the edge of the box. Roberts. Oh! Whisk her away. Riley with a throw into Bell baggy. Bell baggy knocks it through to Montrose. Don't know why he's that far forward, but who cares? Oh, he hit the post. FC United now probing edge at box, passing it about. Okay, what can he do? Nothing. We've defended well. Oofed it away. That's what I'd like to see. Dennis in his pink boots. Out to Bell Baggy on the left. Oh, what a lovely little ding. What's he done there? Oh, Evans. That was a top bit of football, that wasn't it? Fallon on the ball now for United to Wolfenden. Mint name. Wolfenden. Back out to Fallon. What's he done? Try to dink it in. I mean, we're defending pretty well here. That was a crap shot, that, by United. Now, right, come on, Montrose. Go on, Dennis, lad. Oh! No. You never know with that. Sometimes you get a penalty out of them. So, yeah, I don't know if anyone's watched my introduction video. But, um, yeah, I've played this game for another 20 years now. Not so many good at it, but I love playing this game. Got me I've been married two years. Got my wife 11 years ago. <clears throat> and, uh when I got with her I said look you know I play this game pretty much every day and you're gonna have to like that because I can't see me ever not wanting to play it um, and I know a few people have called it the Widowmaker <laughs> but to be fair my wife likes a game on the computer so she doesn't like this game but she's always been sound with it she's just accepted it and, and anyone who knows me knows this is part of me anyway so quite often go to bed with the laptop next to the bed or I mean because it's one of them games isn't it it's not Ooh, it's not like playing on the Xbox where it takes takes you away. You know, you zoned in on the telly. You can have it on your laptop or whatever and you can play a little bit, go and make tea. Play a little bit, go and make a brew. Walk the dog. You know what I mean? You don't have to constantly be on it. Right, here we go. We're on the break here. Go on, Robert, lad. Go on, go on. You can't miss that, but he has. Nice, but... Oh, come on, lads. This better not be one of them where they nick a goal and it's 1-1. One, one. We should have had this game put to bed ages ago. It should be 3-0. Easy. Right, I want to see more. I'm being going to be assertive for you lot. There you go. Things are going well, but I know you're capable of even better. You can do it. FC United kick-off. Jimmy Greaves. Riley. Oofs it. Come on, boys. I'm going to give it to about 65 minutes. And we'll have a look what I can do. Right, Dennis on the ball. Dennis to Montrose. Out wide to Evans. Come on, Evans, lad. Straight in the middle. Oh, come on. Come on. Seriously. What are you... Oh, my God. Okay, I've, uh, I've switched to me. My target man and my poacher formation. Dennis has switched over to poacher. I brought Mr. T on because he's a beast. Um, I haven't got a left back. My left back was absolutely shagged. So Tong, he was a right back. I'm shoving him at left back. But you know what? I reckon it'll be okay. Bill Baggett Roberts still on the pitch. Substitutions haven't kicked in yet. And he's ballooned it. Get off. Uh, come on, lads. Concentrate here. Concentrate, concentrate. Defended well. Well done. Well done. Mr. T now, what's he going to do? Pass it to Hartley. We're playing quite, passing it around quite well. Go on, Dennis, lad. Oh, come on. Hartley to Montrose. Montrose to Dennis. Dennis out wide here to Tong. Tong, go on, lad. Get in your right foot. 
Dennis oops it with his left. Nothing's come of it. Alright, come on boys. Gonna be assertive with them. Courage. Come on, Mr. T on the edge of the box, booms it, nothing happens. Hartley. Back to Fitzpatrick. Fitzpatrick's thinking, what's he gonna do with it? Doesn't know what he's gonna do. He's laid it off to Mr. T. Mr. T's kind of crossed it, shot it. Don't know what that was. Come on, lads. I mean, I'll take one nil all day, but you never know when FM's gonna f bite you in the asshole. Wolfenden to right. Oh, well tackled. Come on, lads. Mr. T didn't go anywhere with that. Won the ball back for Bell Baggy. Go on, Bell Baggy. Straight to Montrose. I like Montrose. My kind of player. Mr. T. Oh. Conley's got the ball. He's ripped it right in. Oh, Dennis hits it wide. I mean, 21 shots. Six on target, says it all. Dominated possession. I mean, they've managed one shot on target. So, you know, we're defending well. We're showing good signs here, I think. I mean, I think Boston are a good team at this level. FC United are a good team. You know, and with the crowd and the passion that will be coming out of their fans today because they're first game at Broaders Park you know and then they do get behind the team at mm -hmm. FC United they are passionate fans you know to go there and win 1-0 I think that's good oh oh no here we go this is what I mean Wolf had done oh he donkeyed it well he didn't hit it wide don't play silly balls oh I like it I like it Mr. T what's he going to do oh he's offside I always wanted to know why he'd never get on the plane I ain't getting no plane just drink some of this milk because you love milk ooh they always drink the milk and they have drugs in it and then they carry him on the plane fell for it every time didn't they one of the best TV shows ever A-Team A-Team and Airwolf got Airwolf as my ringtone on my phone brilliant 80s TV you can't beat it right come on boys Mr T plays it to Dennis who's absolutely shagged don't like he can be arsed anymore it's Patrick playing easy ball. Brilliant. 1 0 at Broaders Park. We've ruined the party. The traitors have had a dick in. I'm happy. Happy, happy, happy. Right. I'm going to be calm. Well done, lads. Good win. So, after two games, episode one. Two good games, really. I think we played alright. The second game, we should have been about 6 0 up. So, two games in. We're second in the league. There's four teams on six points, four teams won two games, but you know, the leagues have started. Um, you know, pretty happy with that. Paul Conley, my right back, is on the assist list. No other players of note. Um, so, yeah, I think what we'll do is I'm definitely going to play the next three games off camera, and then episode two will be against Daily Bridge. So, I hope you enjoyed my first episode. You know, I'm new to this. I'm going to enjoy doing it and putting it all together. So, if anyone watches it, I hope you come for the ride and uh, get a stop put back in the football league where they belong. So, have a good day. Take care. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.